Welcome to my brother, my brother, and me, an advice show for the modern era. I'm your oldest brother, Justin McElroy. I'm your middlest brother, Travis McElroy. And I'm oh sweet, sensual Valentine's oh. Day, brother. Not brother, but s- sensual gentleman, Griffin McElroy, the youngest brother, your brother. Wait, um, uh, wait, are you, wait. Are you their sensual brother? I've got two Ferrero Rochers, and I've put them in a suggestive, sensual position. Mm. Um, my nipples. Oh! I figure, so, listen, guys, pause the show. Pause okay. it. I think that maybe there might be people out there who don't. And we all know that we love Valentine's Day. It's the most important holiday. It's sure. the most sacred yes. holiday. It was invented the most by, natural holiday. The most natural holiday. Jesus invented it a long time ago. And so there might be people who don't have uh, a sensual lover, and so they might want some help, like a pot, like podcast help with that. And we help with every other thing. I don't see why. And it can be completely platonic. You know what I mean? Like a yeah, platonic I, sensual. I do like this though, Griffin, because in the past we've helped people find love. Yeah. And what if we just cut out the middleman, which is us? And we just were like, "Hey, we're here for love." Well, I'm, I I love my wife very, very much. I would never. Uh, I would. There would be. There will be no dalliances today. Thank you. Yes. But I. But we can. But it's like a a make pretend. And listen, if you here's what I'll do. And I, gosh darn it, we done missed it. This is I don't know January or February or whatever day it is when you listen to this. It's not Valentine's Day. But if you want to tell people that I was your Valentine. You no, can. no, no, that's too far, that's too far, that's too far. That's too far? Right. Too yes, far. this episode is, the, the. you can say the episode is. Oh, the episode is your, okay. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Hey, don't lie. Yeah. This episode is your Valentine. Okay. Justin, you want to get a hand on this ball, or are you going to sit this one out, you think? I don't know where the ball is, guys. Um, I It's it's confusing enough that uh, Travis is committing adultery. And no, Griffin no, no, is... no, I'm letting people lie about me committing adultery. No, no, we don't even do that. The podcast episode is your sensual friend uh-huh. for today, the most sacred of all the high holy days. I'm paused. I have these two Ferrero Rochers where my nipples are. Okay. The podcast nipples. Yeah, and then I'm sitting on a bed of poetry. The episode's sitting on a bed of poetry at room for you. you. Yeah, and it's getting the chocolate everywhere. Streaks of it, streaks of it. No, wait, you said pretty plainly that the chocolate was on your Griffin yes. Macaroy's I did a nipples. tumble. I did a tumble. I did <laughs> a tumble into the papers. That does sound like something I would see on Tumblr. That's Son fair. Of a, come on! No, I'm, but Griffin, you're saying, you are you, you personifying you offered I had your a, own body son up of a for chocolate gun. delivery? I was wearing a suit with little Velcro Ferrero Rochers all over it. And the, the, you like have a to, mocap? And you have to, yeah, like mocap balls. And then for Valentine's Day, it's a special treat. You get to run around, try and grab them off me. But I did a tumble into the poetry that the podcast made. No, but you. you're still saying you, Griffin. Um, I thought the podcast was the Valentine. Yeah. I just, I don't see what the fucking confusion is. We do this every fucking year. Start the metaphor over. Was that a Start the metaphor over and don't involve your corporeal form in it. Okay. See if you can do this. Hello. Hi, everybody. Welcome, my brother, my brother, me, etc. And then Griffin says, This is podcast. I love you. Grab this candy. Where's the candy? Wait, wait. Where's the candy? The podcast that is this one has candy all over its suit, wearing it like a mocap. Are you eating, what is, who is eating what right now? Who's eating, who's eating Gilbert grapes right I'm, now? I'm eating up this delicious description you're giving out. Yeah, of a sentient podcast that's down for love. Well, nobody's gonna love this thing now because you guys have, uh, love love. you guys are fucking. Oh, Griffin, you put chocolate on your own nipples. Oh. <laughs> Griffin, did you describe the podcast? You didn't let me? me finish that part. I have it on my nipples, but then it's everywhere else too. No, no, you finished it. 